today, Captain. It's a fine day for any kind of mischief. What's your feeling? I'll make no secret of wanting to see the British brought to heel. If we can take their gold and put it to use ourselves, I'd be a happy man. Spoken like a true Welshman, Addy. <laughs> and what's your aim? Master Kidd hinted at a prize he was eager to show me down in Tulum. Quite some distance, mind, on the Yaktan Peninsula. You trust him to play it fair? I can't be sure. He has a way of picking away at my conscience that gives me pause. I should go see him soon. So long as we take some prizes along the way, I'm sure the crew will understand. I'll set a course for Tulum. Closer from the shore. Hard to buy warned us to be vigilant. Templars have been closing in for well on a year. The Templars make noise with their coming and going. I've not heard a thing just yet. You will. Oh, my God. 
Jesus, Kate. You led me into a mess. Is it these monks guarding the treasure you promised me? I told you I had a secret to share, but I didn't say it'd be easy. Now let's get this door open and I'll show you what's inside. We're on to something. I can feel it. Captain Kenway? What is the assassin, Dunker Walpole? Dead and buried. After he tried to kill me. We are not sorry to see him gone, but it was you who carried out his final betrayal. Why? Money was my only aim. Should I find comfort in that? You murdered our brothers and sisters in Havana. He has the sense, mentor. James tells me you treated with the Templars there. Did you see the man they called the Sage? Aye. Would you recognize his face if you saw it again? I reckon so. I must be certain. Not a word. Come on. You walk me blind and backwards into this mess, kid. Who the hell was that jester back there? Atabai. An assassin. And my mentor. So you're all part of some daffy religion? We're assassins and we follow a creed, ah. But it does not command us to act or submit, only to be wise. Oh, do tell. I'd love to hear it. Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. This is the world's only certainty. Everything is permitted. I like the sound of that. Thinking what I like and acting how I please. Ah! That's a door, I reckon. Aye. There should be some way to open it. A mechanism somewhere. I like a capstan. Mm. Those blocks up there. Try moving them. Oh, damn it. Easy, Kenway. This ain't like climbing ratlins. <sighs> It's you lot then Templars have been chasing them. Until you came along and mucked things up, it was us chasing them. We had them running scared. They have the upper hand now. The door's mechanism seems to be broke. Let's find another way around. Follow on, man. Jump! Enough to curse you with, kid! Great treasure beyond. Treasure? Right. Whatever's waiting at the end of this path had better be worth my time. That'll depend on you. How's that? What I'm taking you to see may spin your head right round. I only hope you can take the shock of it. I can handle myself.
this it, then? The grand prize your mentor asked me to see looks nothing like the man they call the Sage, I'm sorry to say. Keep your trousers tied up. One more riddle to solve. These statues are like the ones we've seen before. Pictures carved on them. There's pictures carved on the floor as well, but not of the same sort. There's a correspondence there. But what? Predators. The other is prey. Which predator goes with which prey? That's the question. Right, there's your correspondence. Match a predator with its prey. Sage. But this thing must be hundreds of years old. Older still. You're certain it's him? Aye. It's the eyes that mark him. Did the Templars say why they wanted this sage? They drew some of his blood into this small glass cube. Like this one? Aye. They meant to ask him about the observatory too, but he escaped. Huh. We're finished here. What the hell did I just see back there? Jim! Quiet. The statue in the temple. Was that the man you saw in Havana? Spitting likeness, I. It seems another sage has been found. The race for the observatory begins anew. Is that why we're whispering? This is your doing, Captain Kenway. The maps you sold to the Templars have led them straight to us. And now the agents of two empires know exactly where we operate. Leave this to me, mentor. They have taken Edward's crew as well. I wonder what their lives are worth to him. Take this. You'll attract no attention, and take fewer lives. You've seen 
this temple in? It's passing. Aye. I'm wondering if it's full of gold and jade and the like. Oh, village. Touch package to get them bonico macabre Has to be, don't it? Where else would the day goes get it? They're pulling it out of the ground, aren't they? Many thanks, but no forgiveness. brought these soldiers. Barnes the Prince himself. He's off me. He ain't got nothing on us. Plague and perish. I may thank you later. Oh. 
Bruce Ayers. Slaver name, Prince. I'm told he has a letter of mark from Governor Hamilton. And that we're to afford him every courtesy. Who's out there? See that mangy old codger? He's a Dutch slaver called Lauren's Prince. Living now like a king in Jamaica. Bastard's been a target for years. Bloody hell, we nearly had him. By God, you bravos are a cheery bunch, eh? All frowns and furrowed brows. Captain Kenway, you have remarkable skills. Oh, thanks, mate. It comes natural. But you're churlish and arrogant. Prancing around in a uniform that you have not earned. Everything is permitted. Isn't that your motto? I absolve you of your errors in Havana and elsewhere. But you are not welcome here. Sorry, mate. Wish it were otherwise. Cheery bunch of mates you've got. You deserve scorn, Edward. Prancing about like one of us, bringing shame to our cause. And what is that? Your cause? To be blunt, we kill people. Templars and their associates. Folks who'd like to control all the empires on Earth. Claiming it's in the name of peace and order. Sounds like the Cass's dying words. You see? It's about power, really. About lording over people. Robbing us of liberty. That another message from one of your friends. Aye. I'll show you. <laughs> 